Hey, what's up guys? Joe Gas here. Today I'm going to be telling you how to make a um, bootable install DVD of Mac OS X Lion. Um, now, the reason why I'm making this is because the only way right now you can get Lion is by downloading it from the Mac App Store for $30. Now, you're not actually getting a physical copy of this. You're just getting an app on your computer that installs the operating system. A lot of people like having an actual copy of it so they can carry it around, easily put it um, on any computer they have without waiting for it to re-download. Not only that, but if anything ever happened to your computer, you'd always have a restore disk with you and not have to go through all the extra troubles. Now, um, in August, Apple is going to be releasing a USB for around $70, I believe, that is going to be a bootable USB of Lion. Now, first of all, if you want that, you're going to have to wait um, about another month, and it's going to be 70 bucks, which is definitely not worth it. So today I'm going to be telling you how to do this for free as long as you have Lion on your computer. Um, let's get started. So we're going to go into your finder. Once you have Lion installed, go to Applications. And go to. you're going to see Install Mac OS X Lion. You want to right-click that and Show Package Contents. Go into Contents. In there you're going to see something called Shared Support. Open that up and then you're going to get the Install ESD.DMG. This is pretty much the operating system, guys. If we get info here, it is 3.74 gigabytes. So you need to keep in mind, you have to have a storage device, whether it be a, well, basically a CD and DVD in this case, that can hold more than 3.74 gigabytes. Now what you want to do, you don't want to drag and drop this. You want to right-click, um, copy, and then paste this pretty much on anywhere other than within the application. So I'm going to put this on my second hard drive here. So paste that right in there. And then it's going to copy. Alright, so it's been copied to another location. Anywhere would be fine, like I said. And also let this be known that you're going to need to do this either before you have Lion installed or after Lion installed. Because you need to have the install Mac OS X Lion app. So you might need to re-download it if you already upgraded to Lion. So anyway, you got that there. Now you're going to want to open up Disk Utilities. So go to your Applications folder and then the Utilities folder. And here is Disk Utility right there. Alright, so we're gathering disk information. We're going to want to drag this Install ESD anywhere right here, right into the left-hand sidebar. You want to select that. You want to press Burn. Now it's going to say, waiting for a disk to be inserted. Right now, you're going to be inserting your DVD. For instance, I have a DVD-R, 4.7 gigabyte. I'm going to put that on my computer. It should be finding it any time now. All right, so it found the disk, and it is ready to burn. So we're going to press burn. Um... I really don't know how long this process is going to take. Probably not be too bad. And that's pretty much it, guys. Now you know how to make an actual copy of Mac OS X Lion. Hope you enjoyed the video. Um, please comment, rate, subscribe. And remember, if you want some, if you want to know some of the more features in depth of what's going to be in Lion, you could watch my other video I made a while back. Link will be in the description. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching.